Chapman. Short. And that's on the paint of the 50. Hawkins gets told it's only six. Goes for the pass. Lonigan off hands. Well, good Varko caught a little high. Handball up. Ball still alive. No free. Jamison. Stevens, who's captaining the team tonight. Good defensive work by the Blues. They're under severe pressure. And yet, uh, well, it's broken down, unfortunately, with a skill error. Taylor to Scarlett to Rook. See the area that Geelong's hurting Carl at the moment. When they move the ball out of the fence, they're keeping it in the corridor. Yeah. Plenty of space in the middle of the ground. It's an ace. Got it from Chapman. Kick smothered. Gets it back again. 50 out. Attempted pass to Ablett. Not good, but he might make something of this yet. Knocked it to his own advantage. Now it's an ace. Mopped up his own mess. Jakura. Burns. They're owning this game at the moment, but they haven't got a massive lead. Lonigan And Otten just snuck onto the field in an interchange, and he's got his hand in the air. Johnson to Taylor. Didn't get a chance at goal. Match last year goes long, and the mark on the line by Thornton. Grip. And now Cloak. Got a couple of yards. Seven plays one. They're sticking with them early. The Blues. Fisher. And now Garland. He can play this kid. He's got a great yeah. footy brain and good athleticism. And Wiggins can play. We know that. But he's not necessarily the main man you want to be going to. Corey. Tenace has had a lot of it early. Again, middle of the ground. Through the centre corridor. Otten's now on. Chapman ran into trouble. Got a kick away. Ling. He's got his own footy, Chapman, at the moment. Captain tonight, Cameron Ling. He is the mayor of Geelong, they call him. Hunt. He can boot a long ball. Can he get that ring road open, Glenn? I'm not too <laughs> sure anybody can get the ring road open just yet, Jerry, but we'll keep our fingers crossed. Good tackle. Speaking of crossed, dragged across the line by Aaron Joseph. He wins himself a free kick. That is Aaron Joseph. Last week he had black hair. And snap cut form's good enough to get it bleached. At least he has options, right? It's true, good point. Joseph in his technical hair this year, perhaps. Chris Johnson. Good lead by Johnson. And now Brown. Joe Brown and a good kick by Johnson. He's had a good couple of games for the Blues. Yep. Fresh to the Blues from Melbourne. Nice mark, Jordan Russell. Now Clogg's got two to beat inside 50. So Russell doesn't just bang it long. He goes to Fisher, who can run and shoot. Runs to 52. To the goal square. Habs and under it. Marks. Gigi took it like a basketball as well. He did, but the good thing about having tools is when there's a bailout kick like Brad Fisher, he looked at the options leading towards him. Traffic was a little bit thick and fast. He thought, I'll just kick it long to the square. I've got a Ruckman going back there that's playing full forward and Sean Hampson, and he took a strong mark. Gee, I think that'll go on the highlights tape for quarter time if they uh, can get a machine out there at least half time because that was just flawless skills in the finish from go to one. Well, we've played nine minutes and scores are level. Yep, from Johnson's kick, it uh, started a passage of play, Jason, I think that uh, they'd be pretty pleased with in the box. Yeah, a lot to like about it. The only thing that you could qualify about the movement is I've already made mention that Geelong have used the centre corridor. Yep. Carlton are coming up the flanks. And I just think if that trend continues, it's going to be harder and harder to find these type of options for the Blues. But it's a great start. You've got to go where the space is and use the players that are free. They did that and they got the rewards. Sean Hampson, another one of the rewards that Carlton got for finishing low. A priority pick. Pick 17 back in 2006. And one of the best things about getting an early goal, Hampson, too, is it puts a little bit of pressure on Matty Scarlett, who can't just play his own game, read the play, feed off and try and be a link player and, uh, and get plenty of possessions kicking out of defence. He's got to mind an opponent. Alton's had experience in the right one-up, but not a decisive clearance by the Cats. We'll get another ball up. So Jacobs, another chance to go at it with Alton's. A tie-up. Corey, third man up. Dumps it wide. Ling in space. It's a half shepherd, but it doesn't sit. Now he's got it, and Burns can go. Have the shot. And misses. And that has been one of his downfalls. He is one of the most inaccurate goal kickers in the comp. He's kicked 27 goals, 48 for his career. 
Shannon Burns just can't nail it when he gets the chance. Probably entitled to have a shot from there, but did have an option in the middle. Travis Varco had found space. A nice shepherd from Rook to let the Mayor of Geelong uh, get a possession. Bauer got it from Thornton. Open forward line again for the Blues. Bentley, pressure. Hospital handball. And he did okay, Hadley. Got it back to Bentley, who can make amends to Wiggins. Slip through his fingers. Still alive. Milburn missed him. Taylor wrapped him up. Holding the ball. And the Cats are away with numbers now. Rook. Played for the 50. Didn't get tackled. Gives them to Nace. Hogan. Ling. Here's the man that carved them up last week. Matty Stokes. Misses the target. Just coming up the ground a bit too much for mine, Jason yeah. Tommy Hawkins, and uh, he would have been on the end of a 15-metre kick there, which, as we know in this competition, wouldn't have paid. Armfield to Bentley to Jacobs. He's a big fellow that leads very well, but he's a little bit predictable at the moment. He sets off early on a long lead, and every now and then you've got to say, well, this lead's not going to be on it. I'll stop, duck back for the long one. Jeffrey Gala, with the rookie list players playing for the Blues, one of their six out there tonight. Cloak. One of their leaders, even though they've got a heap of experience by comparison to some of the Geelong players. Cameron Cloak, just the 47 games of footy. An outstanding 20-game year last year. Jacobs with the palm down. Stokes with the free for high against Hadley. Four goals last week, but not starting up forward this week. Matthew Stokes. Tough one for Rook. It's got three against him. Off hands though, Hogan. Nice collect. Chip kick. Hawkins on the bounce. Caught. Got it up. And the snap at goal is through. The Cats mop that up perfectly. And Simpson nailed the goal. And down on the boundary on Lee Cole, but uh, Harry Taylor just came from the ground. He looked like he was limping, and he's now with the doctor. Yeah, he's just in the hands of the doctor, Jared. but uh, he's had plenty of the ball, so maybe it's a sore foot, Jared. I'm not sure. Could well be. He's the number one uh, possession winner on the ground right now with nine. I think he's just out of breath at the moment, but uh, he'll take a breather, and he'll be back on soon. Here's this goal unfolding. Nice little give from Tom Hawkins and a snap around the corner. Harry Taylor having a rest, as we told you. And Scott Simpson, first kick, is just off the bench. Scott Simpson, one kick, one goal. It's a good start to the game. Uh, Harry Taylor, a key defender with nine possessions, the most on the ground. Ottens with the palm. Greg dragged down. Yaron missed it. Chapman, Hunt, Kelly. Tough ball to mark. Simpson did well. Handed up to Hunt. He can kick a long ball. He can kick it long then. Kick it straight into Chris Johnson. And the Blues are away. Fisher. Open forward line waits. Hanson's on the move. To Greg instead. Now Cloak. That's a pressure kick. The three on three. The spill. Hanson. The flick back. Ellard. Short pass. Not so good from Hadley's boot. Missed the target. Kelly. Laidler coming off a good game last week. One of Geelong's rookie list players. Two Ottens. Missed the target. Gale slung down by David Johnson. Superb tackle. He's an exciting player, isn't he? Young uh, Jeff Garlett. But there is just so little of him. Yeah. And breaking tackles is not going to be his forte. And David Johnson's playing for his footy life. Only played the one game for the Cats last year. Uh, this will be nine. I'm not too sure he can get the journey. Heads wide to Apple. Stokes. Good fist. Hadley thumps it out of play. 14 plays seven. They're hanging in there, the Blues. The defence has been really good tonight uh, so far, the Blues. Up against a more powerful operation. But they are uh, keeping to their job. Ottens against Cruiser. And we'll get another ball up. Talked about Carlton, no Judd, no Favola, Gibbs, Murphy, Waite, Houlihan, Simpson, Walker, Bentick, Scotland. Mitch Robertson's been a good performer, not playing tonight either. I suppose you can count Satanaro Halpin, who might or might not be in their best 22. 
depending on who you ask. And there's the captain for tonight, Stevens, dragged down, ball still in there, Ablett going nowhere.